Hi everyone, my name is Odette Alvarez and I'm in Drama 70 class with Professor Perry. Today I'm gonna I'm going to present a film Les Diabolic Cave and its discreet writing. This one is a 1955 French psychological thriller, film directed by Henry Clouseau. The film is about the principal of a boarding school called Michael and his wife Christina. He's not a pleasant person to be around with and he doesn't really love his wife and also has a mistress that is a teacher of the same school called Nicole. Between Nicole and Christina, it should be hate, but no. They have something like a friendship going on and they plan to kill Michael. After the murder is committed, his body disappears and right after that, a strange situation started to happen around the two women. The screenwriting of the film has a shocking way of comparing humor with it that matter. We can see this in many important dialogues throughout the movie, like when the student who was describing his headmaster say, as a cock in head and pounder, why he needs more than two chickens he already has. One of the key things we should look while watching the movie is that there is no music in there. Regular music in films are the one who give us clues about what to feel or when to feel it. The screenwriting of the film, instead of using music, use emotional reaction in some characters like Nicole. Like in the first part of the movie, the director used Nicole's emotions to alert the viewer, viewer that we should see some things wrong. In the other half of the film, this job is teaching to Christina. She's the one of the main character and this one has a heart condition. Through her, through her emotions and facial expressions, we can perceive her fear and desperation. There are always signal moments that suspense is going to take over the film. And she does an excellent job with this, allowing us to not just hear the piece of her failing heart, but we can also feel it. Another essential element that we have to pay attention to in the screenwriting is that almost every dialogue gives us either a clue about the plot or a better understanding of the characters or even foreshadowing. There is a particular scene early in the movie where everyone is in the school dining hall and Michael is forcing everyone to eat rotten fish for dinner. He even yells to his wife in this scene. And how this scene was set up is a clear explanation that the rotten fish, it can be comparable to him. The screenwriting in this part makes it very clear who is the bad guy in the movie. Well, it manipulates the way we're feeling too. Christine is always shown as a fragile and nice person, while Michael is an abusive person because of what he does from slapping his wife to kissing his mistress in front of her. The character of Nicole is a little bit more complicated because she seems to be helping Christina, but maybe she's not. She can be really mean towards her like when she told her that she thinks like a child or when she told her that she's not worth anything. When we seen her helping Christina like that, but at the same time, during her like this, it kind of let us confuse deciding if we should look at her as a protagonist or if we should look at her like the antagonist of the film. Another important characteristic is how the visual contrast in the two leading women goes together with their personalities. The way Christina does her hair, how she dresses and acts is a little bit infantilized. And also, her head is really small and everyone is always running to protect her like if she was a child. But Nicole, she has a short, she's completely different. She has a short hair, her clothes are tailored, giving her like this look of dominance in, a, in her persona. And she's one of the tallest people in the movie. And she's always looking down at other characters, like kind of to frighten. Well, for me, Les Diaboliques, after watching it, is one of the cleverest and scariest horror films I have ever, ever seen. I will recommend everyone to watch it, but just like Closo say, do not spoil the ending so everyone can enjoy it. 
so that will be it for today and i hope you have enjoyed my video thank you guys for watching bye bye